All right, so this is my print with the Ender 3. It's been going for two days and 16 hours now, 96%. I uh, did not put any supports in the middle. We'll see how that ends up. But it did support the little visor there. And I'll check back in when it's done. Three day long print, almost. All right, it has completed the top without having any problems. Now we're just waiting for it to fill in. It's a couple hours later now. It is at two days, 18 hours, 20 minutes. 99%. Okay, after two days and 18 hours, 47 minutes. Let's see how much filament we got left. Not too much filament. I was a little worried about that, but we are still okay. So I'll wait a few minutes and then let's get this off the build plate. Right, so I just snapped it off the build plate. And let's get these supports off of here. Oh, that's so satisfying. Let's see. Oh, this one already fell off. So this was printed as big as possible for this printer. You see how it's barely hanging? I don't know how it even fit. It was as I had to change the settings and the slicer and everything to make it fit. But it's as big as it gets and it does not fit my head. But it did fit my mom. So maybe uh, if you wanted to print this, if you have children or a wife, then it will fit their head. All right, all the supports are off. Here it is. That is a beautiful looking print. So, if you look at the bottom, without supports, I was very surprised at how well this printed. Just a little bit of wiring there, excess, but easily pulled, I could easily pull that off. And uh, so you don't, helmets apparently, don't really need supports and that saved a lot of filament and a lot of time. I think Slicer said it would take um, three days and 18 hours or something and it, uh, a whole day less without a huge support down the middle. So there it is, two days, 18 hours later. Thanks for watching.